what's going on guys my name is games links and welcome back to doom and it's one of the few times that you can actually say this but welcome to hell now we're not gonna get talked up because well obviously we are in we're in hell there is no one here to communicate with us except except the one person he is here that thing no, I don't think we're actually told who that is in the game, either that or I just haven't really read much of the uh, the lore around it, but, um, yes, that's the only voice in this level, I believe. It is quite a change over the, the UAC, which is the, the tile set we're normally playing in. It is quite a change indeed. We'll set up a portal device at the tomb. Use the nah, I forgot that these guys fought. So it's our, it's our old friend Samuel Hayden. Anyway, um, for those of you who watched episode 5 uh, in the Argent Tower, we picked up the gas cannon. Um, now normally, if you didn't find the secret, you'd find it down there. I'm not sure, not sure if it is there or not. I don't think so. So I'm just going to go straight down here. Anyway, we do have some tasks to complete with it. Now uh, we have to do this thing here, which isn't particularly fun, but if we find a, uh, a field drone, we can get the bonuses for the gas cannon. Now, I think one of them is like a sentry turret, which is really, really fun, and it does an awful lot of damage. Now, what I'm going to try and do here is try and get them all to come over to me, just so that I can uh, use the remote detonation on them. There we go. <laughs> that was my plan. That's five off. We have to do that fifteen times. Anyway, we might as well give the the cannon a little bit more. It can one shot firearms. It can't one shot these hell knights. I, I missed it that time. I think I think it can two shot them. Two shot for a glory kill. I'm not too sure, but it's it's hard to argue that it's not a fan. Fantastic weapon. Nice, and it has a little bit of area of effect around where you uh, where, it, where it actually shoots. Like its influence is marked with the the laser beam, but it actually extends a little bit beyond that of uh, I believe this damage fall off. Oh jeez, hello. <laughs> try and get the headshots on these guys. Oh, that actually took him out. Nice. Now, no one actually mentioned it, but um, I realised myself that I've not been using the super shotgun as much as I should be. I've been using the regular shotgun, and uh, the regular shotgun has... Uh, I, think, I think it does exactly half the damage. Whereas the super shotgun does two times the damage. I just have to watch time for these guys, because I hate the Hell Knights. Oh. <laughs> He suddenly became glory killable. I think that's the shrapnel there. Oh, there's a gas cannon there. Hello, other in. Now, the, the reason why I don't really like using the super shotgun is that it, it kind of requires you to be close, and um, close combat is not something I'm very good at. <laughs> the two of them there. Yeah. Yeah, close combat isn't something I'm brilliant at, which is why I use the explosive shot, because that gives you quite a wide range. That's if you can actually hit the target you're trying to shoot. <laughs> oh wait, there's more. Oh no, I forgot there's two of these guys. Ouch. I'll try and get this one down first. There we go. The other one's just running around him in circles. Explosive shot. I feel like I'm a lot more accurate with the explosive shot than I am with the shotgun. It doesn't really make sense considering the shotgun has a wider area of effect than just the one projectile, but I suppose. Oh, for those of you who have seen Doom Eternal, <coughs> or at least the trailers for it, it looks fantastic. And I've mentioned it a couple of times before in these playthroughs, but I haven't really gone into much detail about it, but I am really, really excited. 
to play Doom Eternal. And it's definitely going to be a series on the channel. I am I'm looking forward to it, I really am. Now these things, I am going to go through as many of these that I can find. I apologise if uh, they get lengthy. So let me know in the comments if you want me to keep pressing these or not, or whether you've all just seen it before. I've come to the conclusion that I am not going to play through those again. That was incredibly boring. I understand it gives you some information on the lore, but... I don't, I don't know what to feel about it. I've heard it enough times. Oh, I only got two of them with that. Oh, I only got two of them again with that one, though. No. Oh, I was trying to get the triple shot. Ah, well. Right, that explosive shot was a little bit risky, considering the weapon self damage is... Uh, hmm. Oh, I did not realise you were... I'm not worried about all that. Take out this guy because they, they start to get a little bit annoying. And the Hell Knights. Uh, classic Hell Knight. It's like, we're good. I think there's another one. Nope, just these things. Ah, oh, the music is just so badass in Hell. It's brilliant. You know what? <laughs> I see another one behind him, which is why I decided to use the chainsaw. And can we get the triple shot now? Yes, we can. Huh. Well, that was nice. <laughs> I did not realise I'd finished it that quickly. I thought there was a little bit more. Oh, well, I'll get... Ah, yes. The plasma ammo. The level design for hell is brilliant. Really could have done it any better than this. This is really good. I'm excited to see what they do in Doom Eternal in regards to level design. Um, as we know, Hell is on Earth now. And the design for that is amazing. Right now, we are meant to go over there. But it, it, I just completely disregarded it and gone over here instead. There, there's quite a lot of there's quite a lot of secrets in this level because it is a really really long level to, be, to begin with. There we go. Yeah, it's a it's really long level. I didn't mean to get hit by him, but I was trying to switch weapons. Now I've got this thing here. And what's down here? Ah. Yeah, I think this is the longest level in the game. I think. I'm not too sure. I, th I think it is because I always see it in two parts. I always have this level in mind of being in two parts. Now this is the end of the first part. Not not just yet. There's a little bit more. Um, but I've never really, I've never seen this be one level. I always think it's the size of two. So I might split this video up into two parts. Depends how uh, how much I end up editing down. In here. We have a quad damage thing over here now, which means it's plasma rifle time, and we have some new enemies to add to the mix as well. I think oh. uh, the plasma rifle with quad damage is beautiful. Oh, hello. I mean, then again, so is the rocket launcher. But it means you can miss more shots and do the same amount of damage, basically. Hello there, Hell Knight. I missed. That was not what I was trying to do. Please die. Please. He didn't die, and it made me sad. That took a while. <laughs> I was expecting him to uh, become killable a little bit sooner. What have we got then? Yeah, out of ammo. Alright, super shotgun time. Okay, so you want to see me die? Oh, that wasn't too bad, was it? Right, now we have one of these big fat ones to put up with. I think it's up there. There he is. Classic fat guy. Oh, what are they even called? I can't remember. I'm still out of ammo on the gas cannon. I'm very low on health. I really do need help. And to glory kill, that was not the right choice. Oh, I have gas cannon ammo. There we go. I forgot that the uh, the gas cannon and what's it? The plasma rifle both use ammo. That was my mistake. 
And it's time for the heavy assault rifle to take this guy out of the sky. Ah, nice. I, I don't think that one went too badly. And here's our first Argent Cell of the level. Alright, so. Health, armor, or ammo. I'm going to go for armor this time. I kind of want to keep things equal. Whereas usually I end up maxing ammo and then dying all the time. Ah, another new enemy. Ah, I, this sounds like one for the, the rocket launcher. We've got all four of them. I'm just going to straight abuse the chainsaw in this one. Oh, the there. What do we have now? I think I know what's coming next. Yep. So, uh, that should be three of them. <laughs> I'm trying to get this uh, external payload thing. I think it does twice as much damage. I think you can detonate it and there's another shot, which I think is brilliant. Alright, so we'll take this guy out, I think. Um, oh, I did, did not mean to fall down there. Not forgot one. Ah, I know where the next one is. He's down there. But I've walked past the spawn point to get this. The chain gun. And there's also a nice little Easter egg here. I think it says Doom written on this helmet. <laughs> Anyways. Oh, the helmet's just one behind us. And uh, we're just gonna kill him with this. <laughs> Here's another one. That's the, and this is what we're gonna get. We're gonna get the, the last power up one, which that lasts twice as long. It just says, increase the length of time that the power-up can remain active, and I, I think it's roughly twice as long. And that one's also nice. And here we are. I'd say this is part two of this level, starting from around now. Because it it's a really long level. Uh, hello there. Just about managed to get that one. That was that was risky. Now uh, this is actually the the room that they showed off at the first Doom at E3. I'm not sure whether it was E3 or QuakeCon, but this is the first room that they showed. And actually, if you went over there, the Cyber Demon would spawn there. Actually. Now, obviously, that's not in the game at the moment, but it, it's just a cool bit of trivia, I suppose. Did I just miss him? <laughs> from like point blank range. Uh, is that another hell nice I see? I think it is. And the amount of time it takes to reload the super shotgun is quite frankly hard. It's hard to cope with. I oh, immediately died of okay. Um, so that's why I keep misjudging a lot of the super shots and shots. I expect it to reload faster than it actually does. One more. There we go. Yeah, that was it. I keep expecting there to be more demons. Yeah, so here's another rune trial. What is it? Launch into a glory kill from much further away. Use the heavy assault rifle to weaken and perform death from above glory. Oh no, I hated this one. I never liked doing this one. That one was not fun. <laughs> there is one field drone here and I'm about to meet it, I think. Right, there is also another... Yeah, there it is. There is also another crater token around here, I think. How many have I got? Have I gotten, I've gotten two out of four. I, I, I'm really sure there is another one here. There he is. I, I know where the last one is. I, it took me it, the longest time to find all four of these Prey Token suits. And we're up. <laughs> now this is where I think part two of this level begins. But uh, we're, we're going to do it in one. I'm going to hate uploading this. 
but we're gonna do in one. Okay, so a precision bolt, which I don't particularly like very much, but it, it means you can move whilst using it, and then you've got siege mode, which is a more powerful beam, but disables movement. However, it has like punch through, so you can you can line up a load of demons and do and use pre precision bolt. And the the last upgrade for it actually um, allows you to move a bit. Although you, you do move slower, but that's why I've been saving up all of my all of my weapon points. Now we have another we have another six, so I might use that just for the faster reload speed on the super shotgun. And as for the other three, I want to use it when we find a weapon mod for the Gatling gun. What, the chain gun? Yeah, chain gun. Um, now, for this one we have to kill three or more demons with a siege mode beam ten times. This is similar to the, the rocket launcher one. So this is siege mode at the moment, I can't move. And this is, uh, I think this is Samuel Hayden finding our tomb where the doom guy is buried. Now I prefer the gas cannon a lot more than I prefer the rocket launcher, so it's time for some siege mode. There's one. Now that didn't kill this beam, so it didn't really That one did! <laughs> so that's the Baron of Hell, they are the largest non-boss enemies in the game. And I think they are Okay, the, the, the teleport effects didn't work for that, and it looked quite, quite strange. But uh, I appreciate it nonetheless. There we go. Now the the, the faster reload is a lot better now. Okay, so we've got another Baron of Hell. <laughs> he came out of nowhere. Okay. There we go, shoot him in the back, and he's dead. Just had to make sure, I wasn't quite sure if he was or not. Anyway, now we have these things to deal with. I'm trying to get three of them at once, but I don't think it's going to work. And I'm very slowly dying. <laughs> I tried to be special, I tried to be smart, but it didn't work. Now, it could just be chainsaw, but I think it's time we use just a little bit of quad damage. There we go. Now, I've got luck. Oh, I can't use the siege mode. That's a shit, right? You know what? Because there's a load of demons down here, I'm going to use the chainsaw on one of them. Just for some ammo. Because. I wanted, it. <laughs> I wanted to do that. There we go. <laughs> Alright. So we have two, uh, three demons fighting here. Eh? Please don't come over here. <laughs> Can we get both of them? One of them will die. So I'm just going to use this on the other one. <laughs> Which one do you think is going to die? Uh, now you're coming over here, really. Eh, there's no chance I'm getting over there in time. Really? He recovered really quickly. He's just watching me. <laughs> there we go. As, as I was saying, the level design for Hell is beautiful. It's, it's, it's amazing. Right, I think it's chain gun time. Now the accuracy over long distances is great. Oh god, it's really not. It's almost always missing it. But it just tears into them when you when you when they actually get into range. That is, it just tears into the demons. Now th there's also a weapon mod that you can get later on in the game, which lets you fire indefinitely, or at least until you run out of ammo, and it does a whole load of damage. That's three out of our ten mobile sieges. Now I want to get the the one for the gas cannon before I get the one for the rocket launcher. Just. Because I prefer using the gas cannon. It's such a good weapon. <laughs> so that's four out of our ten. There's only one more guy here. And we are approaching. 
approaching our next Praetor token. Can we get another one? Now we have to time this one perfectly. I, I should be able to do it again. Yeah! <laughs> 6 out of 10. <laughs> That's the goal for this mission, is just to get some more uh, more progress towards that final it's such a good it's such a good weapon mod just being able to move with it I think that's all it unlocks as well yeah just allows movement and that's really good because it, yeah you get to move around and that's going to save you from an awful lot of damage all right the next part of this level I think this is I think this yeah this is the last part of the level but you've got another two barons of hell to deal with See, it looks very ominous. Now then, I do want to get the siege mode thing. I, uh, none of these guys are lined up. It's not happening. I'd be really surprised if it was. Yeah, hello. <laughs> that guy's not dead. Well, he would be, but he's not. The level gets really, really red at this point. Yeah, it's two in one. So over time, my aim is gradually improving. I don't think it's been too bad this episode. I've missed the shots, but I don't think it's been too bad. Because although I've been playing Doom, I just a little bit more. There, there. Oh no, I'm low on ammo. Okay. We'll do it with the rocket launcher. Did I just miss? Oh, I got him. That does not affect them for very long. Now, this quad damage. I think I'm going to get it now. I know what happens next. After these, we get the barons. Oh, hell. There they are. I think only one of them actually spawns to begin with, but uh, I managed to spawn both of them, there he is, come on, I don't know where I'm aiming because I can't see him, oh I got him, <laughs> nice, Whoa, this is one of the most fast paced episodes yet, I mean I'm, I'm going to be saying that literally every single time because each episode gets more difficult than the last, anyway guys, thank you so much. For tuning in to this episode of Doom. For the two or three of you who have made it to the end of this video, please consider liking, subscribing, and I'll see you all in the next episode.